All right, everybody. Welcome to a uh, part one of the uh, Nexus Prime uh, review. And uh, first up, we have Skyfall. Now, Skyfall here is uh, interesting because uh, unlike uh, the original version that came out with that set, this one had to be altered. The original version was uh, essentially um, an A-10 uh, Thunderbolt or AK Warthog airplane, and uh, you know, very similar to Power Glide and whatnot. And there wasn't really one of those that's like in the Combiner War, save for the Power Glide, which uh, was more of a weapon, so it didn't have like a full-size Combiner limb. So this one was um, based on more off of the uh, Firefly mold, uh, slash Fire Flight. But then there were some um, modifications to it, as there were to pretty much all of them to try to make them stand out more. So let's uh, grab it here and... Uh, We'll remove the uh, hand foot gun ever so gently. And uh, this other gun, which is uh, part of the uh, Bruticus set that uh, you saw earlier. So yes. Now, um, for you um, more uh, eagle-eyed viewers out there, you will notice that there's been a change to the wings. Yeah, these wings were from uh, Shapeways, from Steam Shield. Yeah. You can see they're uh, different, they're uh, straighter bit flatter and the, the idea was to make um, this uh, look more like the um, original um, what about the F-10 mold of uh, the aircraft it's like uh, that fire flight was based after so basically straighten them out I mean not the biggest change of all since uh, the other plane it's like uh, the F-4 actually had like the wings like lower on the fuselage but it straightens them out and uh, helps make it look a uh, different uh, from the other molds because it was also reused for a quick slinger slash uh, slingshot so yes as you can see here originally it was a translucent blue but this one just has nicer more straight blue plane so because you know couldn't alter the plastic that way so yes uh, as I said earlier these were all painted by Cool Jazz and this one he just did a fantastic job as he did with all of them but uh, yeah I'm told that these wings were a real pain it's like to install and uh, move because you have to like pull out the pin so I've been told that's a lot a lot of work yeah so yeah that's just something to consider I'll leave the link in the description uh, for uh, the uh, what you call it the uh, Shapeways parts. So yeah, different plane, but just gotta love these colors. Uh, definitely looks uh, like something Cobra would fly. So yeah, so Skyfall. The original version was first released in 05. And, uh, apparently, uh, he was uh, the whole thing with Nexus Prime was uh, after they uh, split apart they sort of lost their memories like the individual components so it took them a while to for them to get back together and uh, Skyfall here was like the first to sort of uh, have the yearning and the uh, you know premonitions and all those other things that you know there might be more to his life and meaning originally uh, they split apart to different dimensions and uh, he ended up on Velocitron but he knew he wasn't like the other Velocitronians so set out to figure out what his destiny is and origins and all that that's how that story started okay. always a little tricky with the legs on this guy There we go. And there you have Skyfall in his robot mode. <clears throat> I guess. There we go. Now one of the interesting things about the Skyfall here is that despite the fact that the bowl was changed, 
the uh, colorations is very very similar to the original figure it's like uh, the reds and the blues being exactly where they were supposed to be even though the transformation it's like uh, where the canopy basically became the legs and one of the fun things is that Cool Jazz added this detail here, this uh, red spot on the leg, which basically was the canopy of the original version. So, with the way that one transformed, split apart. So that was a really, really cool touch. Yeah, no goggles, unfortunately, but uh, you know you could say that they're downward facing. Yes. It's amazing how this one, like it says, like if you actually like compare the pictures which you can easily do on um, TFW with the, the whole post. You can see how this one like lines up quite well color-wise uh, with the original Skydive. I mean, uh, Skyfall. Yes. And the, then, you know, he has his uh, weapons here. This one here is part of the Bruticus set uh, from the Matrix Workshop uh, 33A. And you can give him his uh, gun there as well. As you saw that in the previous review, those weapons will combine. So yes, that was uh, Skyfall. And, uh, stay tuned uh, next for Landquake. Yep, later.